before, but with new leadership comes new energy. And with that, I'd like to introduce our President and CEO of Kia Motors North America, Mr. Sean Yoon. All right. And just like Kia, Telluride is all about shattering expectations. Big, bold, capable, and comfortable. It's the largest SUV Kia has ever made. Beautifully designed in California and proudly built in Georgia. You know, they say the town Telluride got its name from the mineral tellurium, but there's another lesser known theory that the name came from an old saying, to Telluride, they say. That's what they shouted to the miners brave enough to journey through the rigorous San Juan Mountains in search of precious metals. These were true adventurers, risk takers, fearless entrepreneurs, just like you. And surrounded by peaks reaching 13,000 feet into the skies, this small town is not for the faint of heart. In fact, it's the definition of the wild, wild west. It's where Butch Cassidy robbed his first bank. And today, the remains of the old mining shacks line the mountainside. And unlike some of Colorado's more famous ski towns, Telluride prefers to keep a low profile. You can almost call it Colorado's great unknown. You, you find nothing like this, like chains of restaurants or shops over there. The nearest stoplight is almost 45 miles away and it remains a hidden gem and fully embodies, embodies the feeling of discovery built into the all-new Kia that shares its name. Now this vehicle is the perfect everyday adventurer ready to discover the great unknown places of this country. Equal parts rugged and refined. And we love what the name Telluride stands for and we wanted to make sure that the people who call this home would approve. So we dispatch our Zara PR, Mr. James Bell, to see what they think. Let's take a look. Hello, everybody. I am James Bell, and I'm here in downtown Telluride, the core, the, the absolute heart of Telluride, Colorado. So I think it'll be fun to go around and talk to some of the local citizens and see what they think about the name of our new SUV. Excuse me, sir. Thanks, sir. You look like somebody who knows cars. You look like a friendly face. I'm coming in. All right, so we wouldn't be in Telluride if we didn't talk to some people who've just come off the ski. I mean, look at these guys who are panting, act like they're athletes, they're just skiers. Nicholas, from Houston, Texas. Yes. In Telluride, what are you doing here? Yoga. Yeah. <laughs> I expected many words to come out of your mouth. Yoga, not one of them. I think it's time for a drink. Barman, uh, I'll have the usual, please. Hi, how are you? I came into this town to make sure that people, residents of Telluride, are okay with this. That's the new Kia that's Whoa. coming out. It's cool, it's sporty. It's beefy, it's nice, it's sleek. I like the way it looks, and I definitely can see those cars in this town. Wow. Are you speechless? I think that's a tremendous looking car. Yeah. Wow. How about that interior? There it is. That's nice. Yeah? It's pretty nice. You look good in that car. I would. I think I would look really good in that car. So, so basically what you're saying is you're hitting me up for a free one. Looks like the cockpit of a jet airplane, but <laughs> I'm sure much easier to operate. And then if you go back to those seats, man. Yeah. yeah. I could sit cross-legged in that. <laughs> <Lots of laughs> that's, a, that's a lot of space there. And the name of it is, are you ready for this? Tell you right. No way. Way? Tell you right. No way. I think that looks pretty cool, tell you right, on the back of it. You know what? I drive that car. Yep. That's all we need here. Thanks. Yeah. All right. So we heard it from the Telluride folks, and they love it. In fact, I think James has already taken a few orders. All right. The Kia Telluride story goes beyond the town that inspired it, of course. Deep in the American South, on the banks of Chattahoochee River, sits an abandoned train shed, once the hub of railway activity. And for nearly a century, that train transported goods from the mills of West Point, Georgia, a booming American textile empire. And in the 1990s, 
this town's major businesses shut down, leaving many out of work. But the people and the passion and the skill remained. And in 2006, this young company had chosen West Point for its first plant in America. And today, this facility is responsible for more than 14,000 jobs and builds over 300,000 vehicles a year, including the Sorento, which is ranked number one in quality in J.D. Powers, and now building the Telluride. So the Kia Telluride has roots in Colorado, in Georgia, and in California, but also here in Detroit. This is where we showed and introduced the first Telluride concept a few years ago. And then we popped up during the New York Fashion Week alongside designers of the stars, Brandon Maxwell, and proving once again that high fashion can meet with rugged. But we didn't stop there. Next, we showed up at SEMA to take SGD performance and capability to a whole new level with these wicked machines. souped up beasts can handle the track, but what about the production model Teddy Ride? Well, heck yeah, you can do it. Check this out. everybody, Chief Designer of Kia. Thank you, good morning. Woo! Big, old, boxy, and luxurious. Telluride is ready for anything you throw at it. Pretty much the entire design team in California is into adventure sports. So we designed Telluride to take us and our friends to the places we love and bring back old school SUV design. Yes, it's boxy on purpose to deliver the rugged look and versatility people want. And for the last two decades, SUVs have been made to look more like sedans and wagons. But what happened to the attitude? Telluride will do for SUVs what Stinger did for sedans. We really emphasize the width and solidity being firmly planted on the road. The geometry and surfacing around the DLO, the headlights and the grill speak to what you'd see in architecture. It really embraces simplicity. Everything you see is functional and purposeful. Now around back, the upright approach continues with inverted L-shaped taillights and square exhausts. And it's finished with a Telluride badge of honor announcing Kia's newest flagship. Inside, driver and passenger vis visibility was key. We wanted everyone, especially all the way back in the third row, the people all the way back in the third row, to be able to look out and enjoy the view. Open the front doors, and the first thing you notice are these big, meaty grab handles. It really sets the mood. It makes you think, okay, we're off on an adventure now. The interior is first class, and we included business jet-style second row seats as seen on the, on the concept. The entire experience is authentically upscaled, featuring brushed metal, wood, and leather, all communicating this minimalist approach to luxury. And no matter what model you choose, you won't find any cloth upholstery. Okay, so now we know it looks and feel, feels amazing, but how does it drive? Michael, can you please come up here and tell us what this thing can do? So I'm thankful. 
thank you for sharing with us the inspiration behind this confident and bold design. Telluride's appeal isn't just its strong, tough, go-anywhere exterior styling and its luxury interior fit and finish. Telluride also comes standard with built-in Kia quality. As Saad told you earlier, this truck comes out of the same West Point Georgia plant as the top quality award-winning Kia Sorento. And just like its stable mate, Telluride is engineered to be capable in all driving conditions. So whilst it has everyday versatility, it can also take you up a mountain top, if that's where your journey leads. And we complete the Telluride package with the very latest safety and connectivity technologies, those that maybe you would expect only from expensive premium brands. But this is Kia, and the Telluride lives up to our brand promise of great design, outstanding quality, performance, and industry-leading technologies. That's America's best value right there. So let's take a closer look at what makes Telluride such an amazing entry in the truck market. For starters, we've equipped all Telluride models with a powerful and refined V6 powertrain. Our 3.8 litre gasoline engine produces an impressive 291 horsepower and 262 pound-feet of torque. Pair that with Kia's 8-speed automatic transmission and you get maximum efficiency and drivability. Of course, it's got electronically controlled all-wheel drive, which uses torque vectoring to distribute power to all four wheels. There's the option of no less than six driving modes, including an all-new snow mode to escape those more challenging conditions. Want to take more than just a full vehicle load? Well, this brute can tow up to 5,000 pounds whilst also featuring a self-leveling rear suspension. And how about all of that clever technology? Well, we've literally packed Telluride with everything we can think of to make your drive effortless, enjoyable, and safe. With Kia's advanced driver assist system, Telluride can not only help prevent a forward collision with both warning and brake assist technologies, but with blind spot and surround view monitors, it also helps watch your back and sides. What's more, we've even got technology designed to keep your family and friends safe in the back seat. If the vehicle detects an object approaching from the rear, safe exit assist will keep the doors locked until it passes. How's that for clever? Smart cruise control, lane follow assist, and highway driving assist are all included to make the driving experience more comfortable. In addition to a supersized screen, the onboard navigation includes head-up display, so finding your way will be easier than ever. And we're sure that many new customers will find their way to our dealer stores to experience this outstanding new vehicle. As a new entrant to the segment, Telluride offers Kia a sales potential that we've not tapped into before. And we're confident that Telluride will drive Kia's US sales to in excess of 600,000 units this year and a record market share. Now, the best way to understand Telluride is to experience it for yourself. So please, come and take a closer look. And also, please make sure you stop by the Kia stand to grab some lunch inspired by the cuisine of Telluride, Colorado, and West Point, Georgia. Thank you for joining us today on this great journey. Thank you.
Who wants it shut? Who wants it shut? You don't want it shut. Right, I was going in. 